special, very special. And speaking of special, it's my special honor to announce the student speaker for today's presentation. And I want to introduce to you a man named William Pascali. <laughs> William is a native New Yorker, and he's a man of many talents, as many of us know. Bill attended Plaza to get his GED and to upgrade his computer skills. He was outplaced from a company that had been in business 33 years after working for the company for 12 years. And I have to tell you, that feeling is not a pleasant one, I'm sure. As a working professional, he's definitely been multifaceted. He's been employed as a Teamster truck driver, and a successful studio and a rock musician. <laughs> and I have to tell you that he's successful in all ends. Bill is very personable and is a very caring man and father. As he stated himself in his admissions essay when he came to attend our college, I know that if I have the proper training, I would definitely broaden my chances to be employed in the future. Now's the best time to advance and to work towards having a secure future for my wife, Patricia, and my children. Mr. Pascali has been very active at our college, and he always seems to be there in the heart of our environment there at the school. Ladies and gentlemen, he said that he's always seen our college as a warm and caring environment in which personnel have been like family to all. I'm very proud to announce this year's graduate of the class of 2001 in Computer Business Support Specialist and our student speaker for today, Mr. William Pascal. as one of the many graduates attending our ceremony today. 20 months ago, when I first enrolled in Plaza Business Institute, I was only one person, feeling alone, seeking a way to prepare for a worthy career. I felt unclear about who I was and where I was headed, while all too well knowing where I had been and the struggle I had endured over the years. Was my situation similar to yours? Yeah. <laughs> when I started my journey at Plaza, I met many individuals who took a great interest in me, as they did other students. Among those individuals was the Callahan family, whose vision had made it possible for people like us to receive a higher education and they've done it for over 85 years. They have touched the lives of over a quarter million students to date. We need to thank our families for their support and encouragement. I never quite understood until now. 
This is the story of Bill and Joe, a pair of ditch diggers. Bill and Joe worked side by side for years. One day Joe didn't show up, and as it turned out, he quit his job. Almost two years later, while Bill was busy digging a ditch, he saw a well-dressed man approaching. <laughs> Bill realized it was Joe, and he said, where have you been? What happened to you? Joe replied, I went back to school, and I received an education, Bill. He said, what do you mean? Joe answered, I can show you, Bill. Holding his hand up in front of a brick wall, he said, Bill, punch my hand as hard as you can. So as Bill swung, Joe quickly moved his hand away. Bill hit the wall. <laughs> Bill cried out, what did you do that for, Joe? Joe replied, I now rely on a quick mind and not my hands. Bill, being uneducated, was totally amazed. Suddenly the boss came running over and said, I pay you to work, not talk. What's going on, Bill? Bill said, boss, Joe just showed me what an education was. You want me to show you? <laughs> the boss said, fine, Bill, what's an education? He said, okay, boss. Punch my hand as hard as you can. You know where that went. <laughs> I never understood the moral to that fable until I attended Plaza. I now realize Pop was trying to tell me something. <laughs> You'll probably suffer needless hard knocks in life without a proper education. Before I enrolled in Plaza, I was built. Hard working but taking lots of unnecessary hard knocks in life. Today, standing before you, I feel like Joe. Right. Relying on my mind, on my hands. <laughs> Plaza has opened up a world of opportunity to us by giving us the keys of learning. How we use them is our choice. It's our display of courage, strength, and endurance which will reflect in the eyes and hearts of others as we create the realities of our dreams. We have stepped out of the darkness of fear into the light of knowledge. Every student here today exemplifies class's integrity. We will accept the challenges of our future and embrace the continual love of learning. Our minds fabricated this dream as we have brought it to be. As we take first steps in the fulfillment of our destinies, we may carry the memories of each other in our hearts and our minds. As we remind her of where we've been and where we are headed. Proudly we will say, we are the graduating class of 2001 from Plaza Business Institute. We are one. Thank you. Turn on your TV, Time Warner Cable, Channel 56. There's a wonderful show going to be airing about our multicultural day at Plaza Business Institute. I hope you enjoy it. And now it's my honor to turn the program over to Awards go to Mary 
ele é muito calmo. Paul Rica McDonald. Tina Turner. with a Bachelor of Science in Business. 